alone. Why would I be carrying someone else's clothes? Yes, they're mine. I like the variety in things. 23rd of December, 1988. Finish. Yes. Finley. That's actually how it's <laughs> said. <laughs> yes, it's a, it's a very beautiful country. Have you been? Oh, well, not that many people have. <laughs> Just because we share a border with them, I'm telling you the truth, I'm not the one you're looking for. I've only been there once, and only for a day, without a visa. That picture was approved by the police, it's, it is a valid document. Why would I lie? I never lie. In fact, in 2012, when Finnish people were asked to describe themselves in three adjectives, the most common ones were honest, reliable, and true. <laughs> Apparently, we're also shy, direct, slow, <laughs> reserved, and punctual. So you can imagine our office Christmas parties are <laughs> Holiday. Well, I've come to see my sister. Look for my sister, I guess. I mean, she's not lost <coughs> or anything. She just left kind of in a hurry. Four years ago? Of course she's Finnish. <laughs> <laughs> I say she, but nothing. It's just that in Finnish we only have one pronoun. <coughs> Otherwise I wouldn't really know how to refer to um, her, I think. It's been a long time. <laughs> good, good evening, everybody. It's so good to be in London. I love London. I love it. I absolutely love it. There's so much variety in people, you know? There's white people, black people, Irish people, Asian people, Asian Asian people, like, diverse people. There's, like, there's no people where I come from. And, and those few people there, they're all white. I'm what they call mixed race. Because uh, my, my mum's blonde and Scandinavian looking with nice eyes and blonde smile, uh, and nice smile, and my, uh, my dad's uh, Balkan looking with dark hair and a drinking problem. <laughs> <laughs> We're beyond white. Us having sex is like rubbing two sheets of A4 together. <laughs> it's also just as passionate. <laughs> my brother, he just got a job on TV, he plays Simon Cowell's teeth. <laughs> If you're different, you, you stand out. You do. You, you stand out like a, like a turd in the snow. I don't really know what she does here. She always wanted to travel. Home was never a place for her. Well, imagine a freezer. That's it, really. Just imagine a freezer. It's warm, cold, dark. It's always food. Mainly because it's the kind of food you put in there and forget it's there, so it's nothing exciting. <laughs> My sister, she was she was like a big bag of French fries. <coughs> chips. Yes, that's right. She was like a big bag of chips. <laughs> she, uh, she didn't fit in there. So, um, and then uh, things started to melt. My ex-girlfriend cheated on me. <laughs> that's okay, I cheated her right back. <laughs> We're the same girl. <laughs> <laughs> Partly because I wanted to annoy my ex, but uh, mainly because there is only three lesbians in Finland. <laughs> <laughs> it was 1993, a primary school in the working class suburbs of Helsinki. Midwinter, minus 28 degrees outside. The noise echoes from the walls, elbows, bootstraps, runny noses, snow dragged in and melting in the corner of the corridor. Kids falling over on the slippery surface, we don't do the warning signs you kind of learn as you go. <laughs> Is this specific enough for you? So my sister, she starts taking off her clothes, <coughs> layer by layer by layer by layer. And every time she does this, someone goes... <coughs> <laughs> A girl with long dark hair and pink boots and a massive ball of gum in her mouth looks at her. You're wearing your sister's clothes. No, I'm not. Don't lie. 
Everyone knows you're lying. Everyone knows you're a boy. You're wearing your sister's clothes. But these are my clothes. Liar. <laughs> Liar. So whichever she was, people didn't like it. Hey, you. Hey, you. You. Come here. Come here. Come closer. Come closer. Closer. <coughs> you're ugly. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry. Come, come closer. Come back, come closer. 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 Freak. <laughs> Do you have children? Remember those shape sorting cubes? Did they still play with those? A cubes into the cube shaped hole, triangles into a triangle shaped hole. And if it doesn't fit, they'll start smashing it. Their frustration is almost fascinating. They learn so quickly, bless them. So is this going to take long? I really should be... Well, do you mind if I use the toilet then? Thank you. Sometimes I've been lonely. I just seem to find the right girl. You know, the girls I fancy, they're like butch girls, like, like really butch, like, oh, right. Like, like, <laughs> like the kind of ones that, the kind of girls whose vaginas are like the shape of a fist. <laughs> <laughs> My vagina's not a fist. I think it's more like a, like a friendly wave. <laughs> Why does your toilet doors open inwards? Oh, so if the lock breaks, you can still do your business and hold the door with your hand? <laughs> no. No, in Finland, the doors open outwards, and if the locks break, someone comes and fixes them. <laughs> <laughs> I grew up to be normal, you see, so I don't need to be funny. I just smile. So, um, any documents you uh, want me to sign? <laughs>